lots of contradicting opinions about ACG along with TRT. Regardless of fertility and uh, the desire to have kids, generally speaking, is it a good idea or not? And why? Who wants to start? Yeah, I'll, uh, I'll jump in on that one if you like. Um, so, so yeah, it's, it's, it's a big debate, isn't it? So you'll uh, anecdotally, when uh, you work clinically, you'll see patients that get on great with HCG and then patients that do not tolerate it well at all. Um, and now, you know, in terms of uh, its efficacy, I know they said, you know, they didn't really uh, mind about sort of fertility or having kids or anything like that. Um, there are other benefits if you do, if you are able to tolerate it well. So there's the preservation of testicular volume. Um, so it, it can have a preventative effect on testicular atrophy, which obviously is something that is uh, seen on testosterone monotherapy. Um, but uh, it also can confer uh, benefits in terms of psychological well-being. Like, so you'll see people say that they feel uh, just that little bit better, or they sometimes refer to it as that missing piece of the jigsaw um that uh, where they just feel sort of better on trt when they add in hcg um but then uh you know on the on the flip side you will get multiple patients that that have horrendous anxiety and you'll eliminate any other factors that you can and then finally you'll remove the hcg and that seems to sort things for them so it's yeah. uh you know in terms of the evidence it's it, it can be beneficial uh, for lots of reasons but not all patients tolerate it well clinically in our experience i think what about you angela <laughs> Yeah, no, absolutely. I think it's really interesting. You you made the point about for some people it's a missing piece. You very rarely find a patient who's on the fence about HCG. It's either been utterly awful um, or really good. Um, and there's not really not really many people uh, uh, sort of in the middle about it. But for me, um, some people that I would really be more cautious about it was with people would be people who struggled with significant anxiety in the past because actually. Um, anxiety does seem to be a feature if you're going to experience side effects um, post HCG, one that seems to sort of stand out. Um, but yeah, like Felix says, it says it's some, you know, sometimes it's um, it can actually end up being the missing piece for some individuals. So yeah, but trying to say is is it a good idea? I think is 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 very patient specific. Like you'll you'll either get on well with it or you won't. Yeah, right. absolutely. 